ideal small town country girl would be someone who wanted to play softball, uh, someone that wanted to wear dresses, have long hair, makeup, all those sorts of things. And if you deviated from the norm of a, a small town country girl in any way, it was really hard to get accepted. I'm Dr. Jen Case with Renaissance Periodization. I hold a PhD in exercise science. My emphasis is nutrition and human performance. I also have a dietetics degree, which means I'm a registered dietitian. My bachelor's degree is in athletic training. I have a master's degree in sports science as well. Clay Center is a small farming community in Kansas. Typical of all your other farming communities, you know, cows outnumber the people, that sort of thing. There's a lot of cliques in Clay Center. If you did not fit into those cliques, you had kind of a hard time growing up. I did not fit into the cliques. I wanted to try wrestling. I don't know if the coaches would have let me try. I couldn't get my parents to sign off on it, which was upsetting. So I moved to Topeka and I wanted to take a self-defense class. My parents wanted me to take a self-defense class as well. Um, and then come to find out they did Brazilian Jiu Jitsu in the back room of this traditional martial arts studio. So freshly turned 19 year old, fresh off the farm, not super social, <laughs> very young girl being told, hey, this guy's gonna lay between your legs and you're gonna squeeze his neck with your thighs. So that was a little, uh, a little awkward, but once I got over the awkwardness, I really found that I enjoyed Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. I found a, an activity that I, I excelled at, and from there just kind of snowballed and started to redirect everything in my life. Jen came in and got right in the mix. Good student, which was also refreshing, considering most of those guys were just there to rough it up. She came in ready to learn. So how do guys respond to me? It is varied over the years. I do have some guys that their egos just can't handle it. It's a little more vicious than it needs to be rather than being good jujitsu technique. And, and that's frustrating, but it's just kind of part of the sport. I think the thing that I like the most about jiu-jitsu is just the camaraderie and the sense of family and acceptance that you have at your gym. Uh, and if you don't have it, you're at the wrong gym. As my career took me around to different spots, you know, I would have to meet a new work environment and new work friends, but the jiu-jitsu environment would always be welcoming. And once you got in there, told a couple dirty jokes, you're home. You know, growing up in a conservative area, when you look like this, there's a certain stigma that comes with it, and you just have to deal with that. Um, and the, I think the best thing you can do is just show people, okay, yeah, I look like this, but I also have four college degrees. I also have a job that allows me to interact with people from literally all over the globe. It allows me to work with top tier athletes. You know, it allows me to help people meet their goals on a daily basis. Um, allows me to be able to become a world-class athlete. It does not change who I am, it does not change my character, it doesn't change my values, it's just art. So once I got my PhD, I went on and taught uh, as an assistant professor up in Iowa and then at UCM as well. Um, but then the opportunity came along for me to do Renaissance Periodization full time. I still get the opportunity to educate people about nutrition and exercise science, and so that's very enjoyable. But now I also get to help people reach their goals and help them succeed. And I get to pursue my own athletic dreams, and so it's kind of just a little bit better fit for me right now. It was really 
really cool for me to know that there were young ladies back in my hometown that were following me and you know feeling inspired and being able to um, have someone to look up to and realize that hey you know even though you come from a small town that doesn't mean you need to have small dreams. I'm Jen Case and I'm the Renaissance Difference.